Hey, David and Gilbert, we are going to the movies to see Planet of the Apes and the Great Mouse Detective double feature at Vian Cinemas. Since, we got the tickets for the event. But, legend, Carol Claptrap, and guys, we hate Planet of the Apes and the Great Mouse Detective, besides, these movies are so boring as heck. We don't want to watch these movies. Yep. I agree with Gilbert. We want to see Monsters Incorporated instead. Boys, we are not seeing Monsters Incorporated today. You can watch it when you get home. We are seeing Planet of the Apes and the Great Mouse Detective double feature and that's final. Either you come with us, or else, you will be grounded big time. Let's go. Hello, and welcome to Vyond Cinemas. What movie would you like to see? Can we have 10 tickets to see Planet of the Apes and the Great Mouse Detective double bill please? Okay then, here are your tickets. Enjoy the double feature. Thanks Cinerama releasing. Hello, Hello there, there guys. guys. What's, What's up? up? Hi there Sonic and Tails. We're going to see Planet of the Apes and the Great Mouse Detective double bill. Wanna join? Precisely. Me and Tails got the tickets for these two movies. Let's get into the cinema. Hey, Detective Pikachu, I seen your ears move before. I wanna see it. Of course. So, watch this, Fanakin Flame Boy. Isn't that cool, Fanakin Flame Boy? Yep. Very cool, bro. And how about you Legend, Kororo Claptrap, Sonic, and Tails, can you guys wiggle your ears? Oh yes. I can really move my ears. Yep, I can as well. I have the great ability of your movements. Yes, of course we can. Remember? Yeah. You remember this? Don't you buddy? Yep. I remember that you're moving your ears. It's been a very long time my friends. Oh yes it is. So, the Abbots are about to start right away. Over the seven jeweled hills, beyond the seventh fall, live seven woodland creatures in a cottage small, bashful, sleepy, dark, grumpy, happy. Dopey, sneezy, the one that started it all, Walt Disney Pictures proudly presents Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs, coming to Disney DVD and video, Fall 2001. Starlight, Starbright, wish I may, wish I might. Have the wish I wish tonight. From a frozen land comes an animated adventure to warm everyone's heart. The Pebble and the Penguin. Isn't it beautiful? Is that an engagement pebble or what? The newest member of the MGM UA family entertainment line means guaranteed quality programming for your customers with kids. And Pebble is a Don Bluth limited film. The creator of Thumbelina and all dogs go to heaven. I think you're... Fabulous. You have to gush like that? The Pebble and the Penguin is a rocking good time for the whole family. A real treat for the kids. Fun and educational. The kids will laugh and learn at the same time. Critics and families love this movie. Everyone wants to own Pebble. That was some landing, Hubie. Featuring the voices of Martin Short, Tim Curry, James Belushi, and the incomparable music of Barry Manilow. Such a dangerous world. The Pebble and the Penguin is the heartwarming adventure of one determined penguin. Get your filthy flippers off my girl! Hubie! Who overcomes fierce adversaries and obstacles ah. to find friendship and true love. The how we get along together. You are incredibly annoying. I'll give it two days, Tops, and you'll be in the belly of anything from a killer whale to a sardine. I'm a good swimmer. You've got Eat Me written all over you. 
Strong marketing muscle will make this penguin fly. I'm flying! I'm flying! Yes! Right off your shelves. Oh, goodness glaciers! $5 consumer rebate with purchase of Pebble and a selected MGM UA family entertainment title. TV advertising blitz targeting women with children through October. You're either the greatest romantic hero of all time or you're the Woo! stupidest penguin who ever lived. P.O.P. with impact that won't thaw, including merchandisers, posters, and more. You're, you are amazing. Whoa! This August, for cool family entertainment and hot profits, don't underestimate the power of this penguin. It's not the pebble. It's the penguin. I love you even more. Stock up on The Pebble and the Penguin. One of the year's most enchanting stories is about to bloom. Now, Don Bluth, the director of An American Tale, takes children of all ages on a wondrous and spectacular fantasy adventure that will delight and surprise you. A troll in Central Park. It all begins when a lovable little troll named Stanley... I won't have him growing any more of those things! Flowers? is banished to Central Park by an evil queen. Oh, oh! It feels delicious to be so vicious. I'm the Noga, the queen of me. There, he accidentally comes face to face with a little girl. Troll. And her brother, Gus. I'm Stanley. What's your name? Rosie. Watch this. Together, they share a remarkable journey as they experience the incredible magic of Stanley's amazing special powers. You've got to have a dream. After them! Until the evil queen discovered all the fun they were having. <laughs> now, you too can enjoy the wonder and enchantment of a friendship that grows and blossoms in a movie that will make your heart sing. A Troll in Central Park when you believe in yourself, you can do anything. Police! I've been robbed! Ah, uh, you say it was crispity, crunchity, and peanut buttery? Oh, a yum! Who laid a finger on Bart's Butterfinger? There are six suspects, but only five alibis! What's an alibi? Don't! Find out who doesn't have an alibi and you could win $50,000. See these rappers for details. Name? Sober Hibson. I mean, Homer. <laughs> hey, honey, what you got there? Popcorn from Dairy Queen. Want to try? Sure. Mm. It's good, huh? Hey, wait a second. What, what, what? This isn't popcorn, you idiot. It's popcorn shrimp! Oh, oh, I knew there was something familiar about it. Hold on. Where are the kids? <laughs> the DQ Popcorn Shrimp Basket. So good, shrimp would eat them. Nothing says loving like my chocolate chip cookies. Here you go, boy. Wow! Cookies! <laughs> Who put this back empty? I, I didn't drink it. Who? Cookies? Did you drink it? Me? Um, oh boy. It's goat milk, fat boy! Coffee, I own it. Got milk. A little drum music, if you please. Get ready for the hippest ape of them all. Look out, you beauties. Here comes Donkey Kong. Donkey Kong Country, Legend of the Crystal Coconut. I can't believe I gave the crystal coconut to a couple of the bad guys. Arr, all I want to do is get me booty back. Defend my honor with loot and lies. 
It's the first feature-length 3D animated adventure based on the enormously popular Nintendo game that took an entire generation by storm. Well, blow me down. <laughs> this is no wimpy fairy tale. It's a search for the truth. A battle between good and evil. A quest for supreme power. This adventure could only happen in a thriller of a gorilla, Donkey Kong. And now you can see it on video. Everyone is after it. Featuring all of your favorite characters. Cranky Kong, Diddy, King Cruel, Captain Scurvy, and of course, Donkey Kong. You want it? You got it. Donkey Kong Country Legend of the Crystal Coconut is filled with action, humor, and eight unforgettable funky hip-hop songs. We gotta get the coconut back! Again. So get ready. You'll go bananas for Donkey Kong Country Legend of the Crystal Coconut. Sounds to me like you've lost your coconut. Well, I gotta say, these are some cute lovers here. Yep. Yeah. Very cool, but wait, is there a troll in Central Park movie trailer? Yeah, this movie is so weird. Yeah, and that troll is making my big darn ears move. Also, I have seen Dopey Dwarf. Yeah, these two trailers make my ears wiggle like this dwarf, and this troll. Yeah, this troll and this dwarf always make our ears wiggle like them. Yay, these guys are making my ears move like they do. Well... What if Sonic Boom's Dr. Eggman can wiggle his ears? Well, I don't think Dr. Eggman can wiggle his ears. Well, we can. Detective Pikachu can, Mario can, Legend can, and Kororo Claptrap can wiggle their ears. Guys, relax, will ya? The previews are about to start, right away guys. Jim Rex? What's Jim Rex? Would you believe a movie audience guide presented as a public service by this theater's management to help you select your motion picture entertainment? Well, that's what it is. And we urge you to learn these rating symbols and use them as a guide for you and your family. G means suggested for general audiences, all ages. M, suggested for mature audiences, parental discretion advised. R, restricted, persons under 16 not admitted unless accompanied by parent or adult guardian. X, persons under 16 will not be admitted. This seal in advertising indicates that the film was approved under the Motion Picture Code of Self-Regulation. Friend. Nine killed 
you, nine shall die. Your wife no fives. But you I will kill. But you can't, Doctor. I am already dead. Here, how are we gonna get him off this? You take his head, and I'll take his feet. Let's unscrew him. Dr. Vibes, who samples the finer things of life. In his own inimitable way. And experiments with fascinating instruments of death. Well, what, sir? The guitar. The ten curses visited upon the pharaohs before Exodus. Nine shall die. Nine eternities in doom. Uh, curse of boils, of bats. Frogs? Frogs, yes. And the curse of blood. Curse of hail in the bloody middle of nowhere. Probably the most terrifying motion picture you'll ever see. Where did you get this? On a dig down in Thebes. <gasps> Jonathan, I think you found something. There is an ancient legend of a place known as the City of the Dead. I call it the doorway to hell. Where the earliest pharaohs were said to have hidden the wealth of Egypt. Are we going into battle? There's something out there. Something underneath that sand. They came to uncover its secrets. Mummies, my good son. This is where they made the mummies. <clears throat> they sought to unlock its treasure. And then there was light. Oh, boy. What they did... Oh, my God. It does exist. I think this may be the Book of the Dead was unleash a force unlike any the world has ever known. You must not read from the book! What the hell is that? You have unleashed a creature that we have feared for more than 3,000 years. Whoa! He will regenerate and no longer be the undead. We are in serious trouble. On May 7th, did you swim? If the occasion calls for it. Trust me, it calls for it. Universal Pictures invites you. His powers are growing. What? This just keeps getting better and better. To experience the adventure. It appears he's already chosen his human sacrifice. That will live forever. If he turns me into a mummy, you're the first one I'm coming after. Go! Beyond the darkness, beyond the human evolution, is Khan, a genetically superior tyrant. Exiled to a barren planet, banished by a starship commander he is destined to destroy. Left for dead, he has survived. I'll chase him round the moon of Nibia and round the Antares maelstrom and round tradition's flames before I give him up. 
There she is. There she is. Shoot collapsing, Captain. Can you evade their power? A few shots, son. Not enough against their shields. The base is stubborn. Scotty, I need warp speed in three minutes or we're all dead. I've done far worse than kill you. I've hurt you. And I wish to go on hurting you. I shall leave you as you left me. Marooned for all eternity. Buried alive. At the end of the universe lies the beginning of vengeance. Star Trek II, The Wrath of Khan. Opens at a theater near you, June 4th. At last, science fiction creates the ultimate man, Inframan. And a motion picture creates the ultimate spectacle. Adventure beyond your wildest imagination with the man beyond bionics. Six million light years beyond believability. Is he man or machine? Electronic circuits integrated with living cells in the living body of a man. Powered by nuclear energy. Inframan, you won't believe your eyes. You won't believe your ears. You won't believe your mind. Now, Joseph Brenner brings you the most advanced product of bionic science. Towering above them all. Thunderbolt fists. Rocket feet. Can Inframan survive heat that melts rock? Cold that freezes fire. Is Inframan a match for men of steel? A motion picture that will stagger your imagination. Inframan, the ultimate in science fiction. since we first felt the force, and it's stronger than ever. There is only one way to celebrate the fifth anniversary of Star Wars. See it again.
sir. They're kind of here. Red five, I'm going in. I'll take them myself. Join Luke Skywalker, Princess Leia, Han Solo, Chewbacca, Darth Vader, Obi Wan Kenobi, C three PO, and R two D two. Come on, R two, we're going. Join in the celebration this summer when Star Wars returns to a galaxy near you. Star Wars starts August thirteenth for three weeks only. Force will be with you always. It was an art practiced through the ages. It was a skill passed down through generations. For six believers, it was more than martial arts, it was a way of life. It was Shaolin. But in a time when honor is a thing of the past, they turn their backs on their beliefs, except for one. Now, he is reuniting his best friends to apply an ancient art to a modern sport. It'll take practice. It'll take time. It'll take the power of one last player. Because they're not just taking on the odds, they're taking on the most ruthless team ever assembled. And the only way to win is to believe in Shaolin. Get ready. The sensation that swept Asia off its feet is coming to conquer America. Learn it. Live it. But be careful. How you use it. Stephen Chow. Shaolin Soccer. going to control you now. It is the same spaceship you saw near the moon. That should convince you we do not come from your world. We are here to make you our slaves. From the laboratories and arsenals of all civilized nations, the most powerful, the newest, the most devastating of weapons, into action in their effort to destroy all monsters.
His power is unequaled. His battles are legendary. His return is near. This could be the end of civilization. Get ready. I've spotted him. For the 23rd big screen appearance of the world's biggest star. Godzilla! From TriStar Pictures and Toho Company Limited. Catch the ultimate showdown. It's an alien. Where winner takes all. Godzilla 2000. If you can't take the heat, run. It's watching. It's itchy and scratchy. Our favorite show. Well, you're not watching it. Aw, Dad. Come on, Homer. Nope. It's too violent. Go do something else. Now I'm really bored. I know. Dun 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 dun. dun. It's the Bart Simpson Show, starring Bart Simpson, featuring the Bart Simpson Orchestra. And the Bart Simpson Dancers. And now, here's the star of our show, Bart Simpson! Thanks, Ed. Funny thing happened on the way to the studio tonight. I ran over my dad's head on my bike. I thought I told you kids not to watch violent TV. It's stupid, but it's not violent. Oh, yeah. Bart? Why, you little... Whoa, gotta run. Good night, folks. Hi, Sonic. Thanks for looking after things while I was gone. No problem, little buddy. Did you water my plants? Wait, you have plants? Oh no! Cosmo! Uh oh.
Hey, do you guys wanna? Never mind. Oh, hey, Knuckles. Long time no see. Yo, Knucks. Knuckles. What? Can you even hear anything? What do you mean, Sonic? You don't. <laughs> you don't have ears. What? What if I really don't? Are we telepathic? Well, well Tails definitely is. Who's big? Think these Get thoughts. Get out of my head. Meh. <laughs> eh, what an idiot. Feel the beat. <sighs> well, I gotta say, these shorts are so cool, funny, and awesome. Yeah, I agree with you, Tyler. Sin. These are so cool. Yep, they're hilarious. All right. Wow, Sonic, you're making my ears wiggle when you wiggle your ears in your short film. Yeah, you're also making my ears move, Sonic. Oh man, this movie stinks. I know, right? This movie sucks, so as an American tale, The Land Before Time, and The Pebble and the Penguin. Hey, Gilbert, I have an idea. Let's go ditch from the Great Mouse Detective to see Monsters Incorporated. That's an awesome idea. Let's ask someone to go to the restroom. Hey, guys, may we use the restroom real quick? We have to go really bad. Yes you may, but, hurry, the movie will be likely a half hour left. Thank you Kirby. Come on Gilbert my friend, let's go see Monsters Incorporated instead of the Great Mouse Detective. Okay, Monsters Incorporated is in cinema number 7. Let's straight ahead. There it is, Gilbert, let's get inside. Well, Gilbert, this movie is going to be better than the Great Mouse Detective and Planet of the Apes, don't you think? Well, yes, precisely David. Let's sit tight and watch the cinema. Starlight, star bright, wish I may, wish I might, half the wish I wish tonight. From a frozen land comes an animated adventure to warm everyone's heart, the Pebble and the Penguin. Isn't it beautiful? Is that an engagement pebble or what? The newest member of the MGM UA family entertainment line means guaranteed quality programming for your customers with kids. And Pebble is a Don Bluth limited film. The creator of Thumbelina and all dogs go to heaven. I think you're fabulous. You have to gush like that. The Pebble and the Penguin is a rocking good time for the whole family. A real treat for the kids, fun and educational. The kids will laugh and learn at the same time. Critics and families love this movie. Everyone wants to own Pebble. <laughs> that was some landing, Hubie. <gasps> Featuring the voices of Martin Short, Tim Curry, James Belushi, and the incomparable music of Barry Manilow. Such a dangerous world out there. The Pebble and the Penguin is the heartwarming adventure of one determined penguin. Get your filthy flippers off my girl! Hubie! Who overcomes fierce adversaries and obstacles ah. to find friendship and true love. The how we get along together. You are incredibly annoying. I'll give it two days, Tops, and you'll be in the belly of anything from a killer whale to a sardine. I'm a good swimmer. You've got Eat Me written all over you. Strong marketing muscle will make this penguin fly. I'm flying! I'm flying! Yes! Right off your shelves. Oh, goodness glaciers! $5 consumer rebate with purchase of Pebble and a selected MGM UA family entertainment title. TV advertising blitz targeting women with children through October. You're either the greatest romantic hero of all time, or you're the stupidest penguin who ever lived. PLP with impact that won't thaw, including merchandisers, posters, and more. You're, you are amazing! Whoa! This August, for cool family entertainment and hot profits, don't underestimate the power of this penguin. It's not the pebble. It's the penguin. I love you even more. Stock up on The Pebble and the Penguin.
Jim Rex? What's Jim Rex? Would you believe a movie audience guide presented as a public service by this theater's management to help you select your motion picture entertainment? Well, that's what it is. And we urge you to learn these rating symbols and use them as a guide for you and your family. G means suggested for general audiences, all ages. M, suggested for mature audiences, parental discretion advised. R, restricted, persons under 16 not admitted unless accompanied by parent or adult guardian. X, persons under 16 will not be admitted. This seal in advertising indicates that the film was approved under the motion picture code of self-regulation. Sergeant? Yes, sir. Establish your recon post downstairs. Code red, repeat. We are at code red. Recon plan, Charlie. Execute. Move, 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 move. It's a... It's a big one. Walt Disney Pictures presents a totally new animated motion picture event. Star Command, come in. Do you read me? The story of two toys. Oh, there seems to be no sign of intelligent life anywhere. Hello? Oh, yeah! Ah! Headed for a showdown. My name is Woody... This is my spot. No! I am Buzz Lightyear. I come in peace. You are a child's plaything. You are a sad, strange little man. And playing by their own rules. Draw. Fuck me again. I don't like confrontations. Buzz, look an alien. Where? <laughs> You're mocking me, aren't you? <laughs> Impressive wingspan. Very good. <laughs> oh, what? What? He can't fly. Yes, I can. Can't. Can. Can't. Can't. Can. This holiday season, the adventure takes off when toys come to life. To infinity and beyond. Toy Story. Look out! <laughs> can. Twentieth Century Fox invites you to take an advance peek at the biggest holiday event of 1994. Starring Macaulay Culkin as you've never seen him before. In the world of Richard Tyler, danger is everywhere. Ah! Look, it's Richard Tyler. Go for it, Tyler. What's wrong, you scared? Hey, Rich, come on up. Solid as a rock. 8% of all household accidents involve ladders. Another 3% involve trees. We're looking at 11% probability here. Go down to Gutman's hardware store, buy a pound of nails. We're going to finish this treehouse before dark if it kills us. Under the rain. And into a place where imagination runs wild. Welcome, young man. The library hard, please. I don't have one. You do now. Get ready for the adventure of a lifetime with the Page Master. I'm a cartoon. You are an illustration. Ah! Right now, he's only a drawing, while the most magical film of 1994 is in production. The RC Blues! Featuring the voices of Whoopi Goldberg. Oh, baby. Patrick Stewart. Ah! I Frank Welker from Aladdin. <laughs> Leonard Nimoy. Dr. Jekyll? Yes, sir. And Christopher Lloyd. I am the page master. Producer David Kirshner, who brought you an American tale, Once Upon a Forest and Hocus Pocus, joins director Joe Johnston of Honey, I Shrunk the Kids, and the world's most creative animation designers to bring you an incredible world where Richard Tyler must conquer his own fears. Hang on, guys! I'm coming! That's it, boy! Go for the desert! My hero. The motion picture experience that will open your eyes to all the treasures the imagination can hold. The Page Master. 
coming for Christmas 1994. Princess, where are you? It's very spooky in here. I'm playing no games. Well, at least we know where the princess is. But where's the dragon? DreamWorks Pictures invites you to a land of fairy tales. Hey! Oh, no, 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 no. Dead girl off the table. Where are we supposed to put her? The bed's taken. What? Where an unlikely hero. Ah! You definitely need some Tic Tacs or something, because your breath stinks! Rescues a fair princess. You didn't slay the dragon? It's on my to do list. From a nasty villain. Eat me! With the help of his trusty companion. This is gonna be fun. We can stay up late, swapping manly stories, and in the morning, I'm making waffles. Ah! This summer. Ah! One name spells action. You're not exactly what I expected. One name spells adventure. How about here? Before this is over, I'm gonna need a whole lot of serious therapy. One name. Don't look down. Trick, I'm looking down. Spells romance. Uh, it's no way to behave in front of a princess. Uh, oh, wow. She's as nasty as you are. Come on! <laughs> On your butt. Oh. Oh. And that name is Shrek. Shrek. Thank you very much. I'm here till Thursday. Mike Myers, Eddie Murphy, Cameron Diaz, John Lithgow. You love this woman, don't you? Yes. You want to hold her? Yes. Please. Uh, yes. Then you got to, got to try a little peasant Wreck. Wow. Let's do that again. No, no. Maybe I should just try the first line until you're sure that the attitude's right. I think we need to start laying him down. Okay, let's try that. John Cleese, 22, take one. We are paying this respected professional. Any more comments before I start running? To act like a frog. How do I get myself talked into these things? A frog who thinks he's a prince. Voila! They call me Johannes. Trying to save a swan. Mademoiselle. A swan who's really a princess. Princess and death. And that's just for starters. <laughs> the Swan Princess, featuring the voices of John Cleese. Sure, go on, John Dobb. Race to your death. Sandy Duncan. No, it can't be. Jack Palance. Had to be sneaky, didn't you? And Stephen Wright. No, 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 no. In a fresh spin on a classic fairy tale. Dead. Derek. A magical musical animated adventure. The Swan Princess. Deep beneath the world's greatest ocean lives a sponge unlike any other. Hooray! Bubble Party! <laughs> For years, he enjoyed a carefree life. Hey! Who blew this bubble? But all that was about to change. By tomorrow, I will rule the world! <laughs> Well, good luck with that. My crown! <laughs> Someone has stolen the royal crown! <laughs> Who can stop me now? <laughs> oh! You, be back here with my crown in exactly ten days. He can do it in nine, eight, seven, six, That's eight, four, That's just... six it is then. Now, what is it? The paddy wagon. Sesame seed finish. Steel belted pickles. And under the hood? Wow. 
yeah. Wow. We will begin a journey to become the hero he was born to be. Are they laughing at us? No, Patrick. They're laughing next to us. This November. Hooray for SpongeBob! Get ready. Let's get it on! Go for a big adventure. Oh, boy. <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> big trouble. Things have gotten a lot worse since you left. Plankton's turned everyone we know into slaves. Even Gary. Oh, Plankton. Big twist. Oh, my gosh, Patrick, you have a mustache. So do you. Oh. oh. <laughs> Big action. <laughs> and big surprises when Sponge Meets World. Who are you? I'm David Hasselhoff. For the very first time. Hooray! The SpongeBob SquarePants movie. Something big is coming. Something beyond imagination. It's not animal. It's not mineral. So it must be... Vegetable. Oh, good to see you. What a trip! Set sail for the ultimate adventure. There's nothing like a crew to clean the sand out of your wicket, hey? Eh? Sorry! My fault! Oops. And the tail of the biggest fish in the sea. Something touched me! Hold on, Jonah! You are pathetic. The veggies are at it again. <laughs> Jonah, a Veggie Tales movie. This fall, veg out. Three. Cabin. Underwear. It's one of the most beloved animated classics of all time. I wish I was a boy. Is that you, dear blue fairy? But that's another movie. Ow, you're hurting me, dear blue fairy. How many times I gotta tell you, dog breath, I ain't no fairy! Coming only to theaters. Is it really you? In the fur! Disney's teacher's pet. Wow! Here I come! I gotta be a boy! The musical tale of a dreamer. Him with the dream again. It's not enough you dress up like a boy and go to that cockamamie school every day! Who is so over being Rover. Be a good doggy. This really stinks. You should smell it from down here. What? Until one day... Dr. Ivan Crank claims he can turn animals into dumb human beings just like you. It's my dream come true. Now, he's taking a chance. I've got to meet that man. And unleashing the power of his inner boy. What? Who is that? He looked a lot shorter on TV. Maybe it's the axe. I shall make you a boy. Oh, that is just wrong on so many levels. A boy needs a... Coming only to theaters. Disney's Teacher's Pet. He's good. I wish I had a nickel for every time I've heard that.
gotta go. Maybe just a salad. And, uh, yeah. Oh, some rice cakes. Come on. Well, I gotta say, this is a great day. Yep, I agree with you, KC. Hey, Detective Pikachu, thanks for coming with us. How about a great kiss for you? Oh man, Isabel, my dear, you are making me blush and my ears wiggle so fast. Thanks for the kiss lover. No problemo, my lovable peaky boy. Hey, guys, I heard that Gilbert and David had ditched from the Planet of the Apes and the Great Mouse Detective double bill to see Monsters Incorporated without permission. Oh dear, Meta Knight, King the Deed, they are going to be in trouble alright. Yep, they are in a heap of trouble. And here they are now. Boys, I heard that you ditched from Planet of the Apes and the Great Mouse Detective double feature to see Monsters Incorporated. That's it. Go home to your parents and siblings right away. David, Gilbert, how are you guys watch Monsters Incorporated during Planet of the Apes and the Great Mouse Detective? Also, ditching is not a right thing to do. That's it. You are grounded for two weeks. This means no Pixar, no Marvel, no Star Wars, no television, no video games, and furthermore. Go to your rooms right now. Hello, everyone. I hope you enjoy this cool video. Yeah, this video is excellent. I hope you guys don't put rude comments on this video. No profanity, no disrespecting each other's opinions, no nothing. So, see you guys in the next video. Goodbye. Goodbye. See you see soon. You soon.